Ethers.js is a general purpose JavaScript library that helps blockchain developers build smart contracts on Ethereum. Up until recently, it's become one of the most downloaded libraries compared to others used in Ethereum development. Ethers.js is useful when deploying and testing smart contracts because it integrates seamlessly with a hard hat framework, which is also becoming an industry standard when it comes to Ethereum development frameworks. If you want to build really cool dApps, then your smart contract should have the ability to connect to Web3 wallets like MetaMask. This will allow individual users to interact with a payment system built into your dApp. Let's go through the installation process of Ethers.js. Instead of just installing Ethers.js by itself, let's use a real world example of setting up an Ethereum project template with Hardhat Toolbox. This will allow us to install the Hardhat framework to act as the scaffolding to our project. During the installation of Hardhat, a plugin called Hardhat Toolbox will also be installed. This plugin includes Ethers.js, along with some other helpful dependencies. Open up a terminal and create a folder onto your desktop. Now cd into that folder and run these commands to install the dependencies. Here is the Hardhat Toolbox plugin that includes Ethers.js. Wait for this installation process to complete and then open up your project into a code editor. Inside of my Hardhat framework, we can see a package.json file right here. If you click on that, the file will view all the dependencies that were installed. Here you can see the Hardhat Toolbox plugin, which includes Ethers. Inside of the deploy script, you can see that this template was created using Ethers right here. Ethers is communicating to our lock smart contract and making the connections necessary to talk to the blockchain. Great, now let's deploy this contract and watch Ethers.js in action. To do this, we can run this command and activate the built-in simulated blockchain that comes with Hardhat. Here you can see a list of accounts and private keys that should only ever be used in testing purposes and never with real money. When we type this command into our terminal, our lock contract will be deployed to the first address running on the Ethereum hardhat node. And there we have it. We just deployed a smart contract with Ethers.js. And remember, if you wanna take your blockchain skills to that next level, come join Eat the Blocks where we have tons of lessons and teachers on staff to help grow your Web3 knowledge.